Look at this. Can you see the difference? Like, even mistakes like that where you have this watercolor washy look. I actually love it. And hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Marta here. And I'm delighted I can welcome you yet again at this desk with this beautiful tool. Why am I back to you so soon after posting a video about the stamping platform? Oh well, because so many of you have seen my previous video and a huge amount of you have commented on it and you had some bit of a laugh uh, today with uh, my video and me too afterwards I realized after editing I realized the way I was actually stamping it and using the platform and yeah I, I'm glad I could make your day and you were laughing a little bit or a lot and no uh, Tim Holtz didn't leave any comment maybe better because he'll be uh, laughing in his pants if he's seen the way I was opening my platform and using it and yes I was thinking I have to come back to you straight after I read all the comments and the comments are keep on coming uh, and uh, record a new video about few tips and uh, advices that you ha you have given me because I believe I'm not the only silly Billy here in this crafty world I'm not the only one who is either unaware or just I'm such a I'm, I live in a, under the rock sometimes I'm, I'm in the midst of things and thanks to you guys because you are leaving me those beautiful comments and uh, my butterflies you are uh, giving me things to talk about you giving me best things to share with you all so I joined all of the comments and grabbed few important tips and advices re regards using the platform so I hope you will stay tuned uh, I hope you will check my previous video because I think it was quite uh, yeah quite funny the way I was using it <laughs> So I'm gonna I'm gonna change it now. I'm gonna show you that my platform is actually not broken. So let's go and let's uh, let's share that tips with you. First of all, I was using my, my platform like that, which is what? Horizontal, vertical, vertical. And why is that? I don't know. I was just thinking that this is uh, how I love it. This is how I like it. And some of you were thinking that my platform doesn't fully open and it, that it's breaking. Actually, broken. No, actually, it is. Here is my tripod. Here is my tripod. So I, it just stayed like that. So many of you were say, <laughs> saying that you were thinking that. and. And because I wasn't opening fully, I was taking it down so I could stamp. And then I was putting it back so that I could stamp again. No, Marta, you take your stamping platform, you turn it horizontally, yes, indeed, and <laughs> you are opening it fully so that way you don't have to, totally, you don't have to, um, you know, um, worrying about any movement of your paper, of your stamp, of your whole machinery here. So that's one super important tip. If you left-handed or if you right-handed, so however you like. Uh, so taking this off to oops to stamp, it's probably not the best of the idea, but you know what? Maybe that shows you that I am seriously, um, yeah, not really uh, following many things because I I'm recording videos for you instead. Simply as that. So. Another important super thing and the most important thing is those two little magnets. Now guys, thanks so 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 much for giving me the tip of putting my magnets into washi tapes because I have broke uh, one, one magnet have actually chipped and you said that it's much easier to separate it which is true. It's also much easier to lift it afterwards because it was impossible to lift it. So I have this most cutesy uh, washi tape with cats. The cute washi in the world uh, oh, look it's up ah! so it will protect it from breaking obviously don't ch chance it don't try it all the time but it will keep it mm, it will be more better for protection of it and yes let me show you quickly how I do it I don't have third magnet so I'm gonna just use a coin simply as that and I have the washi tape here I'm gonna use the cat one again. So what I did is I just took part of my cat, of my washi. Obviously, <laughs> it doesn't have to be cat. It can be anything, <clears throat> any kind of. Also, it can be the what you call it the duct tape. Yes, duct tape. 
it can be duct tapes for some their washi didn't work so uh, you can use duct tape and what I did basically to make it prettier I just cut it there I just cut it on top and voila it's done and dusted and your penny or um, scent is hidden where the uh, cat head is <laughs> so anyway uh, this is a little tip so basically much easier to lift it, much easier ooh, much easier to separate it and yes, Team Holt seemingly have mentioned do not put them together next to each other because they will either break or it's nothing good. Another super extremely important thing, do not keep your phone too close to it because it's no good. The magnets are so strong that just keep them away, keep them far away from your um, uh, keep from your phone. And that's one of the important other little aspect is that those little magnets are really little. And if you have small kids, just be very careful. There were there was some case I was told under my in the comments under the video uh, that some baby swallowed it and it was swallowed both. I think keep this away from little kids that's to me and Hannah obviously um, what else yes the way of stamping I'm gonna show you the stamping way as I was told to again I didn't see the video but let's stamp it uh, together and the stamping platform came in this box and I indeed have kept it kept it I didn't destroy it or anything I will use it for the future video maybe pretty soon and we will alter this box because it's sturdy it's beautiful it could make a perfect beautiful um, shadow box or that kind of altered frame so we're gonna do that now one more little tip is someone have mentioned that if you will put your magnets too far here on the edges and you will close it that maybe it will be harder for the stamping to work the platform to work you know just to be aware to maybe put the stamp the, the little magnets closer to each other experiment with that guys I'm only passing your comments I'm only passing your ideas uh, because I was thinking that if I'm such a silly goose um, definitely um, I'm pretty sure there must be one or two people doing the same way as me so why don't I share this uh, this uh, experience with you so I have my cats here yes it is much easier to lift it it is it is a definite awesome uh, to use it so put them separate and now great thing about this uh, my, this uh, platform I haven't mentioned before is the fact that there is opening so it doesn't hold your paper as in uh, it's just you can make have your paper bigger basically that's what I was trying to say <laughs> now I'm gonna place my magnet somewhere not too far this time and I'm gonna place my butterfly again but you were saying to try and 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 um, to try and make one color then stamp it another color and stamp it so that's exactly what I'm gonna do and try it again at least quickly I think I was do using the platform wrongly because I'd, I thought that I'm not in the frame of my video <laughs> So it was easier to do it uh, um, vertically, but anyway, we have some district distress oxides, uh, so I'm gonna try that. Um, yeah, why not? Why not? So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna make this um, I'm gonna make this what you call it? Make this. Um, oh, it doesn't. Why is my inking doesn't really stay there? Maybe it's because I cleaned it with my washi tape. But anyway, the idea is not washi tape, my my, my baby wipe. <laughs> it's late now guys. I didn't plan to make this video. Oh I love that. I didn't make plan to make this video because uh, because I wasn't. But uh, then after reading the comments I was putting Hannah to bed and I was thinking, you know what? <laughs> Maybe this is a huge need for this video. Uh, tips on how to use the platform and how to, yeah, just, you know, small things like that. And thanks to you guys, as always. I do read your comments. I know maybe uh, I don't always reply. I can't. It's like already, uh, it's an hour of the video uh, being published and there's 100 literally 100 comments right now so you can only imagine how many comments we're gonna have tomorrow so yes I'm trying to reply as, uh, to as many as possible as you can imagine let's see if I can clean this clear this off oh uh, so yes uh, I think I've seen someone uh, using roll like that recently somewhere on the videos 
on the on the stamps. That's cool, isn't it? Which one will match? Probably yellow, but uh, maybe this blue actually. I'm gonna go go with the edges. I'm gonna concentrate on my edges. So that's what you were saying to me, Marta. Why don't you try to stamp? Uh, color by color and I was doing everything together so you see I'm learning a lot from you thank you so much I think this stamping journey is gonna be our new thing for this year last year we had watercolor we just we were discovering love for watercolor so I think guys we are ready to rock the stamping world today together so if you have any ideas for future video about regard stamping please let me know Okay, so this is awesome indeed because it is all the time in the same place. I don't have to worry that I have moved anything. So yes, it is cool indeed. I have to say you were right guys. So thank you so much. I'm not sure why it's this not stamping. Am I, am I what? Am I didn't press it properly? Maybe my magnet should be somewhere else. Will I see? Or am I actually? No way. Look at that. I am stamping. In the wrong. <laughs> uh, no way. Definitely, Tim. Tim, don't watch this video. I'm telling you, I'm making you the worst review in the world right now. I was stamping with the rubber stamp side. Not rubber. Yeah, the rubber, not the cl clear one. I mean, but you know what's beautiful about it? And I'm going to finish this off to see the difference. Uh, it's what's beautiful about it. Oops. What's beautiful about it is this watercolor look, wash look. Am I the only one seeing this? I hope you can see that too. Let's not lose hope that I'm able to finish off this uh, this butterfly actually, even though I'm using the wrong side of, of stamping. I thought I'm making some favor you now by, uh, you know, making proper video this time. Uh, so yeah, I, I think I'm doing it worse, but it's okay. Let's... That's why it doesn't want to stamp. Okay, I'm gonna leave it at that now because I don't want to break my stamping. Oh yeah, you cannot, you cannot take it off until you're really in the right position. Then it's you don't have to, you don't have to really stress yourself over uh, what I'm doing. Over, um, I cannot believe it how silly I am. I'm worse than I thought I am. So yeah, okay. This is bad. I'm taking one more paper. So let's change that now. You know what? I'm not even sure I should publish this video, <laughs> this video right now because it's worse than 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 yeah, it's worse than everything. So make sure you're not going to let no teams about this video because he's going to think that I'm a lunatic or something. He he will definitely think that I'm a lunatic. So, yeah. Or maybe quite opposite. Share it with him so he can laugh with us. Okay, I'm gonna. Oops, I'm gonna stamp it where I want, which is let's say I would love it here. <laughs> and yeah, it's fine like that. So will that work now? Or am I in the wrong position again? No, I think I'm not. What am I doing something wrong? No, it's fine. It's clear now. It should work. Okay. <sighs> Marta, Marta, Marta. Okay. So, stamping, stamping, stamping. Okay. Beautiful. Now, now we're talking. I'm going to redo the color just a little bit. I really would love this to be beautiful and intense. Okay. So, now we know which mistakes to avoid, isn't it? I'm going to clean this off. I'm going to clean this off. I'm not going to use a baby wipe just in case I'm contaminating some kind of... Um, some kind of... Um, what you call it? Some kind of pigment... Um, not pigment, but like, you know, uh, liquid to it. Now, I hope this will work now. Yay, it's gorgeous. Oh, look at that now beautiful you see thank you so much my dear viewers my darling friends of my Remy's small art YouTube channel without you nothing would work nothing you are the best of the best here and I'm so grateful for having you here I really am so thank you so much and I'm gonna finish off with this blue 
Will this? Will, I'm not sure if it's gonna be nice, but I will do it. We'll do it. So without you, <laughs> this wouldn't be equally fun, I think. Oh, some pen just fall down. Okay. Now. And we're gonna have some contamination disaster of colors. <laughs> wow, I love that. Oh my gosh, I love that. I really do love that. I'm in the face of really loving the platform and loving the whole idea of colors. This is giving me so much now of, um, what's the word? It's giving me, it gives you so much uh, that you can do so much. I'm gonna still go with the dark edge just a little bit, just a little bit. I really am. Just a little bit, a little bit. Okay. Am I having a new love right now, stamping with the platform? I, actually, I couldn't believe it. So many of you have left a comment saying, Marta, I bought the platform last year. Ha well, last year, yeah, a year ago, let's say. Haven't opened it yet. But I think you just, in, in, you just, um, you just made me f wishing to open it. So I will. <laughs> you are the best, guys. You know that. Thank you so much. I wish I'd be able to reply to every single comment left on my channel. I really wish. I, you know it's impossible but I'm trying I'm trying now this is gonna be whoa I hope <sighs> Queen of Stamping <laughs> Queen of Stamping yes oh my this is so fun this is so fun are you ready are you ready are you ready are you ready and are you excited as I am I don't know if I should be pressing like this for 20 times or it's one enough I'll try it and test it but at least now I really wish this to be beautiful and pretty okay oh, look at this now okay <laughs> I can call this experiment finish and the video what not to do it being actually probably perfect so thank you so much again for being here with me for leaving me comments love support for sharing my videos for commenting for uh, loving loving and exploring art with me thank you so much please do share this video with your friends because i think it could be not only fun but maybe informative as well so thank you so much i love you loads i do love you but i have to leave you it's nearly 11 p.m time for movie night with my lucas and uh, why not so thank you so much happy crafting happy stamping and don't forget to make sure which side you're using uh Anis. you love the watercolor look Thank you so much. Love you. Bye. Bye-bye. Actually, my Lucas asked me uh, when I just stopped recording. He said, would you really not be able to make it that pretty without it? And I just showed him. Look at the trials from the previous video. I'm going to bring it closer because uh, it will really show you um, the, the first trial and the, the being wrong with it. If I can anyhow make this sharp so this is it this is one then we have this and you can see that I it's like kind of moved tiny bit so it's not as sharp and the colors they don't really they don't really blend in as beautifully I thought they do but now after this trial look at this can you see the difference like all of the colors really blend in because I haven't purely washed uh, everything from the stamp in a way and yeah, it's it's just different. It's amazing. It's am fantastic, and you really sh you really have to see the difference. You you I hope you can now see the difference, e even the stamping. The way uh, probably Tim has showed you the the stamping. T uh, I just didn't see it. I just wasn't watching it. But you know, it's nice to explore and make even mistakes like that where you have this watercolor washy look. I actually love it and I'm not even sh I'm, I'm not sure of one thing if using wrong side of the platform will not m break it I would worry about that um, I don't know but I love this unperfect look actually to be honest but this butterfly girl this is something out of this world for me so no you wouldn't be able to do this with the block stamping block that's what i've said to my lucas when he asked me after i stopped filming you wouldn't because you cannot place in exactly same spot each time i've tried plenty times with the happy birthday that it didn't work and i tried to re-stamp it forget it 
So for that simple reason, it is worth the money. It is worth to, to, to wait for it. It's worth to have it. And imagine this butterfly, beautiful butterfly and happy birthday here. Enough for your card. It could be for you. It could be uh, for wedding. It could be anything. Simple image like that, but how wonderful. Okay, with this huge excitement that I hope you can feel in my heart because it's it I feel it, uh, you know, that my heart is racing from excitement. So I hope I showed you something quite interesting. Thank you so much and bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>